Hey, this is Jake Habitat Solutions, and I'm standing here revisiting the Cave and Rock switchgrass and sorghum combination screening that I planted two years and about 10 days ago. So this is the third growing season, but you can see it's doing really well. And I wanted to bring up a couple of points today that really make sense as to how to be more successful. I've released a couple of videos, the original video showing how I initially planted it, showing the sorghum and switchgrass growing together, and then I did a video last fall updating how well the switchgrass was doing after I had cut down the old sorghum and let the debris fall to the ground and kind of work in. So a couple of points that I'd really like you to consider, number one, good weed control. So before I tried this experiment, I had planted Northwoods Whitetails HD plot screen here about three or four years in a row. So every year I would come through and brush hog the standing brown sorghum in the spring, disc it in, I'll spray it with glyphosate to take care of the competing weeds and grasses and have a very good stand of sorghum. I did that, like I said, for about three or four years prior, so I had annually kept at reducing the weeds here. Another important factor to consider that might contribute to some of the guys that have tried this and haven't had the same success that I have is make sure your soil is warm. If you plant too early or when the soil is too cold, then the switchgrass will not get a chance to emerge and the sorghum comes up and shades it out and keeps it from germinating. And one of the other factors that really is important is you've got to have some kind of cooperation with Mother Nature. Uh, timely rains, the first month to six weeks of this process really will make you look like a king. Another thing to think about is your screen sorghum population. How many seeds per square foot or square yard? Don't put them in too close. There's got to be some space for the switchgrass to get some sunlight so it can germinate. Well, I hope you can see that now that I am in growing season number three, the switchgrass is really looking good. Um, this is about, I'm going to guess right about 10 to 12 feet wide and it's doing exactly what I want. Over here on this side of me, eight or nine days ago, I planted my soybeans and I also put some oats in, just bin run oats as a nurse crop to kind of take the pressure off of the soybeans as they're young and emerging. So I really think that most of you guys with fairly decent soil can have the same success that I do and still have your sorghum screened the first year and a follow-up successful switchgrass screen year two, three, and following. Good luck and good habitat.